A Minnesota man's annual snowmobiling trip out west nearly cost him his life. Wade Anderson was riding near the base of a mountain in Wyoming when he got caught in an avalanche. He says he was buried in about three feet of snow and could not move. WCCO's Jeff Wagner explains how a pivotal purchase made just before the trip is the reason he's alive. I like all the deep snow. I like the scenery. It's beautiful out there. For Wade Anderson, the back country in Wyoming is a winter wonderland. His yeah, wife, Robin, it, so. sees it differently. Every time he goes snowmobiling, I, I worry about it. He gave her good reason last week. I wanted to climb this uh, hill a little bit. He says his camera stopped rolling right before he drove straight into an avalanche. It's like hitting a brick wall. I hit it and dead stop. Flew off my sled and started sliding and rolling. Buried in thick snow. It just forms like concrete. Anderson was luckily wearing his avalanche bag. You have the little handle that you leave out. And he says he had just enough space to deploy it. You just pull it. The airbag kept the snow from collapsing on him and also stuck out just enough for a guide to find him within minutes. It was his first trip with the bag. And now I'm thankful every day that he made that purchase this year because it saved his life. That'll release the air. The demo he gave us was literally the second time he's used it. And the next might be a lot longer down the line. I was told I couldn't go next year. He was told he couldn't go more than just next year. <laughs> That's because it's not just his wife doing all the worrying. I already told him he's never going again. <laughs> but an entire family happy to keep dad close to home. Anderson says he'll never, never tell someone they have to buy an avalanche bag. Instead, he'll just tell them the story of how the one he owns saved his life along with the help of his friends. Yeah. Wow, Jeff. All right. Thank goodness.